There is always something exciting to see at the Pittsburgh Zoo and PPG Aquarium. Selena Papiani visited Kids Kingdom to learn all about the newest additions. Hey everybody, Selena Pompiani here. I am hanging out with my buddy Henry Kasperzik, the curator of Kids Kingdom and Reptiles at the Pittsburgh Zoo and PPG Aquarium. Henry, who are we hanging out and visiting today? Some of our newest animals. We have nine alpaca in Kids Kingdom. This was a deer yard and years ago we wanted to emphasize some of the wildlife we find in western Pennsylvania. But deer have become so common, we said we got to do something else. And so we got the alpaca in and alpaca are native to South America. You'll find those animals in the Andes. Uh, they are not a pack animal. You might think alpaca, they, they are pack animals. They are actually raised for their wool. And so you'll find these animals in very cold climates. Uh, their wool was very dense and it makes you know, great hats, scarves, and sweaters. So uh, these animals, unlike the llama, which is a relative of the alpaca, is, are never used to uh, uh, move heavy loads or anything of that nature. So these animals are you know, primarily now found in areas that people are raising them for almost like uh, a special interest animal. Yeah, and how many do you have here total? So we have nine, and they are all named after candy bars. It was a staff <laughs> idea to name them after candy bars, and Hershey's the darkest, uh, which stands out the easiest, uh, for me anyway. And how long have they been here at the Pittsburgh Zoo? I know, I'm, and I'm sure the kids absolutely love visiting them. Yeah, we only put them out this year, uh, so they're a new animal uh, for mm -hmm. us, and in the winter, we'll actually not have these yards open. And I know you were talking about trimming them. How difficult is it? I think you did a fine job. Well, that, yeah, <laughs> when you're shearing them, they're not, they, they came off pastures and they were just running wild and they were young and they were never sheared before. If you ever gave a kid their first haircut, I remember my son getting his first hair, haircut, he was not compliant. All right, so we have alpaca and llama food. Believe it or not, they make this up. So put your hand out, you can just see that they will oh. eat right out of your hand. And who is this? Do you remember the name? This is O. Henry. Oh, O. I'm Henry, you're hungry. <laughs> plus years, I've not had an animal named after me. This is as close as I come, because there was a candy bar. All right, who's hungry? <laughs> come on and get it. All right, we'll send it back to you guys in the KDKA studios. They I love sure, it. I do. They sure do love hay. They were we, chomping on that hay. Yeah, but they were very <laughs> polite too. Like they didn't push their way to Selena or anything. Sure. They like sort sort of waited their turn. I agree. I didn't know alpacas were so polite. And so darn cute. Yeah.